Good morning, North Sound, and welcome to another episode of TGI Tiger News. My name is Tom Bond, and I'll be filling in for your host, Matthew Tesler. Let's start off today's show with the Daily Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, let's see what's going on this week in North Sound News. Come out and support tonight's annual Art Against Abuse Art Show at the Hammy Museum at 7 o'clock. Spring sports are starting up next Monday. To all upperclassmen, be sure to hand in your varsity options forms by next Friday. Get ready to spring forward when we move our clocks ahead one hour this Sunday. That's all we have for this week. Let's kick it over to Emma for the Weekend Weather Report. Hi, I'm Emma, the weather woman, and here's what's happening in your neck of the woods. Today will be mostly cloudy in the low 40s. Saturday will warm up slightly to the high 40s and possibly low 50s with less cloud coverage and a clear day, while Sunday will be a bit chillier in the high 30s with a 20% chance of rain. Have a great weekend, North Salem. No, it's I before you accept after C. All right. Oh, hi. Welcome to Dan's Dictionary. In light of the recent inclement weather, we're asking students what the word inclement means. Severe. Rough. Merciless. Harsh. Stormy. Hey, North Salem, and welcome to CC's Corner. In honor of John Travolta's mishap at the Oscars this weekend, we'll be asking students to Travoltify their names. Let's go. Jachetto. Sidney Baraya. Muriad Heffernan. Christopher Wollashine. Annie Bell. Sean Weissner. Hi, welcome to ESPNS. This week we asked North Salem students who they're rooting for this year in March Madness. Iona College. Connecticut Huskies. Green Bay, Final Four. Wichita State. Florida. Syracuse. Duke. I'm rooting for Wichita State because they're the underdog. Hi, and welcome to Matthew's Meats. This week we're going to be cooking a nice big sirloin steak. First thing we're going to be doing is we're going to put some nice dry rub on it, and I'm going to throw it on the grill. How does that sound? First we're going to put the dry rub on. We use this nice spice that we import from the great state of Texas. It's called lantana. Sprinkle a thorough amount of the spice on. First what you're going to do is you're going to go on thoroughly on the first side, rub it in a little bit, yummy, and then you're going to flip it over and do the same on the next side. Rub it in, there we go. Let's take it to the grill. All right, let's get cooking. So what you're gonna wanna do after a couple of minutes is you're gonna open up the grill Look on the side that's been flat on and see how it looks. Turn it nice and brown. We're going to turn it over. Let it cook for a couple more minutes. All right, so a couple minutes ago, what we did is we cut the steak open and we looked to see if it was cooked to our liking. It was a little raw, so we let it go on for a few more minutes. Now it's perfect. We're going to take it off and get ready to eat. Oh yeah, ready to go. So our steak's ready to eat. Let's dig in. You know, it's important. When you're eating the steak, enjoying it with all these wonderful condiments, or maybe just plain, you have to remember, stay hungry, North Salem, and have an A1 day. Thanks for watching this week's episode of TGI Tiger News. Have a great weekend and an A1 day. <laughs>